CES 2010. Now, walking around the show floor, we found this interesting little uh, tool here, and uh, I introduce you to Martin. Now, Martin, we have a, a Spider 3 connected to a TV, but you're not doing calibration in the normal sense. Tell us about it. Exactly. So we're very pleased to introduce the first world's integrated calibrator in a television. So portrait displays along with data color introduces the HDMI Spider, which is integrated and embedded with software and hardware as a combined solution for doing TV self-calibration. Now what that means is that what the user can, can buy the TV and then quickly set it up correctly for his room? Exactly. So the, the user now is going to have the luxury of being able to automatically and easily calibrate. What's going to happen is the new TVs that we're working with many partners on are going to incorporate the new hardware calibration device and the embedded software, as you can see here, that will allow you to go in and push a button and do a self-calibration, as well as take into consideration the ambient light environment, which is also measured in red for ongoing manageability and best viewing experience. And for the ambient light, this is a new feature on the back of the Spider 3, isn't it? Yes, exactly. So this is the existing hardware technology, and it incorporates both a puck device that'll read all of your color settings on the television, as well as this little sensor right here that's going to incorporate the ambient light to do the most effective adjustment for both today and ongoing manageability of your TV viewing experience. And for those people who don't understand the whole point of calibration, this is going to basically set the TV up so when they watch content it's either made for broadcast or made by Hollywood correct. they're going to see it in the correct color space in the correct white balance correct grayscale exactly so all of those factors luminosity are all taken into consideration and the goal here is we really want to make the best viewing experience on not just the highest and most expensive televisions where people typically have a very extensive calibration process done but we think that HD and the TV technology today should allow for optimal viewing and best experience because this is really now now all about take advantage of the best panel quality and calibrate. And how many people manufacturers wise do you have interested in this? Oh, we have everyone from the leading manufacturer brands, and unfortunately at this point, we're under NDA and can't disclose, but we would expect that you might see some model shipping in 2010. Uh, everybody from the highest end to some of the uh, tier B and C companies that also have an interest, because clearly they're all looking for some advantage and product differentiation. Now, some people would argue that they're trying to get this technology into a TV from $1,500 under, it's going to be difficult for accuracy um, with something like a spider. Yes. What would you say to them? Well, I think there's an easy answer now. So the good news is that this is a product that's going to ship in volume. We can take this technology and do a lot of cost reduction on it. We believe that the cost data and the bill of material that would be provided to the TV maker is not going to be that great because this is going to be a volume product. The embedded software is going to provide for that solution. And so the goal here is about providing a real good price point so that this value proposition becomes realistic and not just a great technology that never happened. Well, Martin, I want to wish you the best of luck with this. Thank um, you. We're, we're behind you on this one. We think it's great technology and it's something you really should push. So the best of luck. Great. Thank you for visiting us.